These are Cuisenaire rods. We can use them for a variety of things in mathematics, but one of the things that we can do with them is represent addition. Now in this case, we want to represent addition of decimal numbers. So in order to do that, we have to assign a value to the rods. In this case, this orange rod, I'm going to assign a value of 1. So that would mean that this blue one would be 9 tenths, 8 tenths, 7 tenths, 6 tenths, 5 tenths, 4 tenths, 3 tenths, 2 tenths, and 1 tenth. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to write down an addition expression that we want to solve. So here we have 2 and 7 tenths, and we want to add 1 and 6 tenths. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to represent the 2, and then I want to represent 7 tenths. So this is 2 and 7 tenths. Now I want to represent 1 and 1 and 6 tenths. So now all I need to do is put them together, but hmm, that might be a little challenging. So let's do a little bit of decomposing here. Let's take the 7 tenths and let's change it to 4 tenths and 3 tenths. Okay, so we have the exact same amount, but all we've done is we've just changed the blocks. So now what I'm going to do is look at putting them together. This one is 6 tenths, ah, and that 4 tenths goes with it. So now when I look here, I have 1, 2, 3, 4, and 3 tenths. And that's how we can use the Cuisenaire rods to add decimal numbers.